Poland's Ministry of National Defense announced a significant £3 billion, $3.08 billion or 12.1 billion zlotys, foreign military financing FMF, loan from the United States. This funding highlights the deepening defense partnership between Warsaw and Washington and is set to enhance Poland's aerial combat capabilities through the procurement of AH-64E Apache helicopters. This recent loan marks Poland's third FMF loan in a span of months, bringing the total U.S.-backed financial assistance for its military to an impressive $7.08 billion. As the largest recipient of FMF loans in recent years, Poland is solidifying its position as a key NATO partner on the eastern flank, particularly amidst escalating regional tensions. The contract for the AH-64E Apache helicopters, signed on August 13, 2024, aims to accelerate the delivery and integration of these advanced attack helicopters into the Polish armed forces. Known for their cutting-edge targeting systems and combat effectiveness, the Apaches will significantly align Poland's military capabilities with those of its NATO allies. The collaboration involves American defense giants, including Boeing, Lockheed Martin, and General Electric, who will serve as offset providers in this program. Technology transfers to two aviation companies within the Polish Armaments Group, PGZ, are part of the agreement, fostering local industry participation and enhancing technological expertise in Poland. This procurement deal is not only the largest in Polish armed forces history but also one of the most significant global contracts for attack helicopters. According to the U.S. Department of State's notification to Congress, the extensive package includes advanced equipment designed to bolster Poland's military capabilities. Key components comprise 37 and slash APG-78 longbow fire control radars, enhancing targeting precision, and 96 and slash APRC-48B modernized radar frequency interferometers, MRFI, for improved electronic warfare and threat detection. The armament stockpile is equally substantial with Poland set to acquire 1,844 AGM-114 R2 Hellfire anti-tank missiles, renowned for their effectiveness against armored targets, alongside 460 AGM-179A Joint Air-to-Ground Missiles, JGM, offering multi-mode guidance for diverse threats. To strengthen air-to-air -air combat capabilities, the package includes 508 FIM-92K Stinger missiles, along with thousands of Advanced Precision Kill Weapon System, APKWS, guided rockets, enhancing accuracy while minimizing collateral damage. Beyond munitions, Poland will benefit from comprehensive logistic and training support packages, ensuring the operational readiness and sustainability of its new fleet. Notably, the package incorporates manned unmanned teaming MUMT capabilities, enabling seamless coordination between manned helicopters and unmanned aerial systems for advanced reconnaissance and combat operations. The introduction of 96 AH-64E Apache Guardian helicopters will significantly bolster the capabilities of Poland's army aviation, albeit accompanied by training and logistical challenges. The offset program aims to assist Poland in maintaining the readiness of its Apache fleet, with training for Polish pilots and ground crews already underway, supported by the U.S. Army. The AH-64E Apache Guardian, developed by Boeing, is the most advanced variant in the Apache series, featuring significant upgrades in avionics, sensors, engines and weapon systems. With enhanced T-700G-701D engines, the helicopter boasts improved speed, agility and payload capacity. Its advanced avionics suite, including data networking technologies, allows for real-time communication and coordination with other aircraft and ground units, enhancing situational awareness and mission effectiveness. To support the operation and maintenance of the new helicopters, the Military Aviation Works No. 1 SA in LODS will establish a support center capable of conducting maintenance at various levels for selected helicopter components. Additionally, a center for the operation of T-700-CT-7 family engines will be established in Dublin, ensuring efficient engine maintenance. Poland's acquisition of the AH-64E Apache helicopters aligns with similar moves by other U.S. allies to bolster their fleets. Countries such as South Korea, the United Kingdom and Australia are also enhancing their Apache capabilities, reflecting a growing reliance on these helicopters within NATO and Allied forces. Moreover, armed forces are increasingly turning to the AH-64E Apache to counter the rising threat of unmanned aerial vehicles UAVs. The helicopter's sophisticated sensors enhance its ability to detect, track and engage fast-moving aerial targets like drones, adding a crucial layer to modern defense strategies. Poland's defense policy emphasizes territorial defense and NATO membership as central pillars, particularly in the face of Russian aggression. 
protecting its border with Belarus and reinforcing military capabilities have become paramount. To this end, Warsaw has significantly increased defense spending, furthering modernization projects. The United States has played a pivotal role in enhancing Poland's military capabilities through various arms sales and defense agreements. A cornerstone of this support is the acquisition of F-35A Lightning II stealth multi-role combat aircraft, with deliveries expected to commence in 2024. This initiative aims to modernize Poland's air force with advanced fifth-generation aircraft. Poland has also made strides in strengthening its ground forces through the procurement of M1A2 Abrams main battle tanks and the Patriot Air and Missile Defense System, highlighting a comprehensive approach to military modernization. The acquisition of the High Mobility Artillery Rocket System, HIMARS, further enhances Poland's deterrence posture along NATO's eastern flank. Military cooperation between Poland and the United States continues to deepen, with plans for the permanent stationing of U.S. troops in the country. Poland's government remains committed to boosting military personnel numbers and enhancing defense capabilities to address regional threats. In conclusion, Poland's acquisition of AH-64E Apache helicopters, backed by substantial U.S. support, represents a significant leap in its military modernization efforts. As Poland positions itself as a leading NATO partner, these advancements not only enhance its defense capabilities but also reinforce the collective security of the alliance amidst growing regional challenges.